Hey everyone and welcome to Filmatic. So with Batflick leaving the director's chair for The Batman, speculation on who will take his place has been a hot topic in Hollywood. So here are our thoughts on who should direct The Batman. And before we kick this video off, Zack Snyder is not on this list because, well, he's rather shite. Edgar Wright. Yet we're starting this off with someone maybe no one has considered. Now we all know that the DCEU wants to lighten things up after the depressing Man of Steel and Batman vs. Superman, so who better than Edgar? With amazing hits under his belt like Shaun of the Dead, Scott Pilgrim and of course Hot Fuzz, we think he will be great at lightening up the Batman but keeping the action high octane and the mood gritty. Plus it means he'll get one over Marvel for screwing him over with Ant-Man. Gareth Evans, have you seen the raid? Need we say more? We know Gareth can deliver on action, awesome cinematography and grittiness. He's a major up and coming director, which when working with a reboot or rebirth of such an iconic brand as the Bat, Youngblood may be the best way to go and help grow the franchise. Plus you know the action scenes will be next to none and will put the warehouse scene in Batman vs Superman to shame. Chad Stahelski. Riding off the success of John Wick 1 and 2, Chad might be the right guy for the job. In both John Wick chapters, he proves that he can direct stunning action sequences and character driven passion. Yes, from Keanu Reeves. Every time we start watching John Wick's here at Filmatic HQ, within five minutes we're all crying like babies. So just think what he could create with such a complex character like Batman. George Miller. Let's just forget Happy Feet and focus on Mad Max. Wouldn't it be amazing to see the crazies break out of Arkham and the Bat having to round them all up and all done through Miller's eyes? It would be a thing of beauty. It would have amazing set pieces, breathtaking fight scenes and all that mayhem set loose in Gotham, all for Batman to sort out. And you know it will be a visual masterpiece. Matt Reeves. Now Matt is the hot favourite to get the director's chair for the Batman. Even Batfleck himself wants Reeves to direct it. And who would blame him? Reeves brought to life the thought to be dead Planet of the Apes franchise. With the brilliant dawn and no doubt to be amazing War of the Planet of the Apes, he could really push the Batman movie into something special. If he can make you feel for a stupid CGI ape, then if he directs the Batman, you know it's going to be special and it's going to help refresh the franchise. So there we have our picks for who could direct the Batman. Who would you like to see direct the movie? We'd love to know, so comment below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button.